So in this video, revealing the top three ways to make money working from home and how complete beginners earning $100 a day to $5,000 a month with no experience. More with that after the intro. <laughs> Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. We literally have a 62-year-old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days, so sign up for it now. So my entire life, I don't know why, maybe it's because my parents are like super Asian from the Philippines, but it almost felt like I was destined to literally work in a dental office. Like it was like, oh Mike, if you wanna go ahead and succeed in life, you can be whatever you wanna be, but you have to be a doctor, dentist, lawyer, or nurse. And those are like my only options, right? So of course I just thought, oh maybe this is what's gonna create happiness for myself. I'm gonna go ahead and go to school and get good grades and get a job and become a dentist and all of these is gonna be crazy and it's gonna be amazing. Oh, but I just need to go ahead and borrow a bunch of money for, for example, from, you know, like student loans, pay for, you know, college, and then get a job so that I could pay back the student loan debt that I initially grabbed to go ahead and get college in the first place. And at that point, like when I first thought about it, when, when, when someone told me I had to decide what I wanted to be when I grew up, I just didn't even think twice about it, right? But as I was getting more and more into the reality of this was gonna be my life, being stuck in this cubicle for the rest of my life, doing the same thing over and over and over again, and literally looking in the mirror and seeing my face getting older and older and more sadder and more unhappy and more unhealthy, I started realizing, man, maybe I don't wanna do something like this, like do paperwork in a dental office for the rest of my life. Maybe there's something more than just doing this. And I realized like, you know, earlier on, my parents always worked. They always worked. And because of that, I was always just kind of like either with babysitters or just like, you know, kind of like responsible for my sister, right? And I started realizing that in the future when I, when I will have kids and when I will start a family, then I do not want to spend all my time at my job where someone doesn't value me, but instead I'd rather just want to spend more time at home. Which is why I wanted to go share with you guys the top three ways to literally make money working from home. Because when I figured out some of these ways, not only did I start making money working from home, but I realized if I can do this from home, I can literally do this from anywhere in the world. I can do this while traveling and just taking my shirt off, like in some crazy waterfall in Bali, and, and just literally living my life and traveling around the world with the people that I care about doing the things that I wanted. Remember, before it started off with traveling, it started off with finding a way to escape the confines of the cubicle and to find a way to work from home because when you can work from home and earn from online, you can literally do this from anywhere in the world because home can be wherever you wanna go ahead and hang out. Does that make sense? So one of the best ways that I think for complete beginners that have no experience whatsoever is literally finding you know, a work from home job with Amazon. But it's not the way that you actually think because some of these things, these work from home jobs with Amazon pay $100 an hour, right? Like just check this out, right? Literally if I scroll down to some of these work from home jobs with Amazon, $100 an hour, this one $75 an hour, this one over here literally gets paid $100 an hour. So what the hell are they all doing, okay? so. Back in the day, I wanted to go ahead and make money with Amazon FBA. Maybe you've seen it because you've seen ads like this, like, oh, make money with Amazon. It's the best way to make money, right? Like all these things, right? Uh, so what I had to personally do was I had to go ahead and spend a bunch of money at, on products from China and ship them over to Amazon to sell them. And because I was already deeply invested in the products, I had to find the best pictures and the videos to go ahead and sell them. Does that make sense? So I remember I hired someone to go ahead and like do Amazon photography for me and she charged me like 100 to 200 bucks. And it was a little bit more expensive for pictures, but like, heck, I'd spent thousands of bucks, so I needed to go ahead and make my money back. So I needed to get like really good high quality pictures, right? And I was so amazed with the pictures and they helped me start selling on Amazon that I hired her for like video work, right? And she started charging me four to $7,000 a month for like three to four videos a month like TV commercials almost of like my, 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 my uh, Amazon FBA products. And it's because people that sell on Amazon, they're willing to invest in photography and videography. So what does that mean for beginners? If you are artistic, if you are creative, if you already like taking photography and pictures and stuff like that, and you're good with the camera, that's one of the highest paying like work from home jobs and opportunities. Like right now, like look at this, Amazon photographer, $100 an hour, right? Product photographer for Amazon, 80 grand earned, $100 an hour. Look at this, $50 an hour from Ukraine, $75 an hour from Russia, $100,000 earned simply from photography. 
So this is like a really good work from home job to just begin with. Now the second really good work from home job is understanding how to sell on Amazon, but for free. Okay, because traditionally, uh, when, when I tried selling on Amazon, I would have to go ahead and, for example, get a bunch of money, invest in products from China, and then try ranking for very competitive keywords, like for example, grill mat, where the average is like 18,000 reviews that I had to go ahead up against. 18,000, 7,000 reviews, and all these other ones that get like 18,500 reviews. Super, super competitive, right? But what a lot of people are doing is they're for free selling products in non-competitive markets, like if I type in Beagle gifts, notice all these things that pop up. This means there's thousands of eyeballs searching for these every single month. And if you could put this in your title on Amazon, you could get potentially found on Amazon. Now granted, look at this, Beagle gifts for Beagle lovers. This one has no reviews and it's on the first page. So which one do you think is more easier to, to compete against? Something that has 18,000 reviews that you literally have to spend money to play or something like a t-shirt where you don't even have to create the design, but you could even sell on Amazon for free without investing a single dollar in inventory, right? That work from home job and opportunity is merch by amazon.com where you could sell designs as Amazon products, reaching millions of customers worldwide with no upfront investment or cost to you. All you gotta do is upload a photo or a picture that you don't even have to create, set a list price, they print what's sold, fast shipping with Prime, and you earn monthly royalties for free. So how are people doing this? Number one, they're finding proven designs, okay? So they're literally going to you know, Pinterest, typing in cat t-shirt. What are people pinning? Because they want to buy it later. Same thing, they're going to Redbubble, they're typing the word cat t-shirt, they're seeing best selling. What are people already buying? And they're going to Etsy, typing in cat t-shirts, and they're seeing what people are already buying with a bunch of reviews. Look at this, I do what I want cat t-shirt. If I literally pull this up, you see that this person has made 13,000 sales. Okay, so these people are making a lot of money, right? Uh, but if these designs and sales are doing really well on one platform, what people are doing is they're literally going up to Upwork, typing in graphic designer, going and hiring people from the Philippines for less than $10 an hour or below, and they're literally hiring people for $6 an hour that get 100% job success to do these designs for them. And what they do is they create like a portfolio for free of designs and pictures that make them $100 a month profit. So think about it, you wanna make $1,000 a month in passive income, like what would that do for you, right? Where would you go? How would that help out with the bills? Who would that help out in your family, right? That is literally $1,000 a month for only like what, 10 designs? 10 designs that pay you $100 a month in low competitive niches? That's why it's really important to go against things and keywords that don't have that much competition. Does that make sense, right? And the third way to make money working from home at a work from home job is doing something similar, but taking advantage of like, you know, a very low competition barrier, right? So let's talk about content, right? How are people making a bunch of money with content? You know, you literally have people that maybe will come to Google, type in 13 fat or best fat loss supplements, and you can see that some of these people literally go ahead and create these contents, these blog articles, right? Um, on Google, where essentially when they go ahead and click on any one of these fat burners, what happens is they literally get an affiliate commission on it because they recommend it. Does that make sense? Whenever they click on this picture and they go ahead and buy it exactly where they go ahead and recommend it, this company, this website will literally make money off of it. It's known as affiliate marketing, right? And it's one of the best ways to make money working from home because of the fact that you don't need your own product, you don't need your own service, you don't need to have to do customer service, they pay you most of the money with very little risk to you, and you don't have to do anything else other than like promote it. Does that make sense? Like my mom would be so good at it because she's so Asian and every single time she gets her eyebrows done, she's like, oh my God, ladies, this is where I got my eyebrows done. And she literally recommends the product to like her friends and they go ahead and buy it but she never gets paid for it. Affiliate marketing, you get paid for it, right? So what a lot of people are doing, like for example, on Amazon, is they found out that, oh my God, like look at this. If I type in the word free weight loss, there's people looking for free weight loss books. So what people are doing is they're literally creating their blog articles, but instead of on their own blog, which may take like some money, they're literally creating it on Kindle or kdp.amazon.com for free and they're creating their blog post as if it's a paperback book or an ebook. And when people go ahead and download this, which you can see this is only 15 pages, right, on Kindle format, so it's like big text, right? Each one of these, like fat blasting hacks, are products that they're recommending to. Does that make sense? So what a lot of people are doing is they're going up to ClickBank for free, and they're signing up for free, and then they're promoting weight loss supplements for free. Some of these people on ClickBank, literally, 
A thousand people have made money with this in the past 30 days and they're getting $149 commission from this. So imagine you do this and you rank something, you get, I don't know, a sale a day? That's what, three grand a month profit? Right, so do you see how this starts adding up? And ClickBank alone is one of the ways that I started making money working from home that got me from zero to eight grand in 30 days with literally no product, with no shipping and handling in the health and fitness niche. Does that make sense? And it's not just me, there's literally people that are even doing faster and better ways with these working from home opportunities that are brand new this year ever before that you literally have Dina, a stay at home mom, go from zero to 30 grand a month working from home in five to eight weeks with this brand new opportunity. If you wanna know exactly what she did step by step, then sign up for this free workshop below where it's literally the fast and easiest way to make money working from home. And literally check out this video and this podcast right here. Hopefully this helps, love you guys, see you guys later, woo!